Central Point woman is out thousands of dollars as Metro Area Police investigate a fake diamond scam they say is targeting the Latino community. NBC 5's Roma Villapicencio is live in Medford at this hour where it all happened. Roma. Art, it happened here at the Rogue Valley Mall. A woman was approached by two other women who convinced her to buy fake diamonds. Now, Medford police say they are investigating. They're alluring and glamorous. They come at a high price. <laughs> Israel Hernandez has been selling diamonds for 30 years. The knowledge here that could have come in handy when Medford police say a 29-year-old Latina woman was caught in the middle of a fake diamond scam Monday afternoon at the Rogue Valley Mall. She's approached by this Hispanic female who says she has some diamonds she wants to sell her. Basically has a story where her husband was involved in an accident and she needs to sell some of these diamonds to help pay some medical bills. Medford Police Sergeant Brent Mack says the suspect had a second accomplice who convinced the victim they were real diamonds, costing the victim $6,000 for Fugazi's fake diamonds. Hernandez told me in Spanish, Lamentablemente, pues nuestra comunidad le falta más... Unfortunately, our community needs more communication, more help, and there are some things they're not familiar with. Hernandez says he sees at least 10 people a year come into his shop, Yasmin Jewelry in Medford, with either fake gold or diamonds. Sergeant Mack says for some reason, this particular diamond scam is targeted at Latinos. Why do you think it's Latinos? You know, it's a very good question. I, I don't know. We, like I say, about twice a year, uh, this happens. Both Hernandez and Mac agree it's crucial to get any jewelry checked out by a professional who can verify them, especially diamonds. Hernandez says, si no saben, por más que se les explique, If they don't know, it doesn't matter how many times you explain it, they won't be able to identify it. It has its characteristics that they should know, the clarity and how the diamond is because there's zirconiums that look a lot like diamonds. Sergeant Max says they do not have any suspect descriptions yet, but believes these are traveling criminals. If you have any information, you are asked to call Medford Police. Live in Medford, Roma Villavicencio, NBC5 News.